Hi guys, my name is Ashton Ligurski and I go to school at Black Hill State University in Spearfish, South Dakota. I'm in a degree program called music education that will allow me to become a music teacher eventually. I have a few more classes to go. But today I want to talk to you about one of my two favorite instruments, the bass clarinet and the contra alto clarinet seen here. Now the clarinets are in the woodwind family, like the flute and the saxophone. And the reason why they're called woodwinds is that we use wood to make our sounds. The wood being this reed right here. The reed is made of wood and is connected to the mouthpiece by what we call a ligature. And this ligature helps to hold the reed in place so it doesn't fall out. Now, if I play the mouthpiece and the reed together, just this, it sounds a little strange. Not very musical, I would say. But if you put the mouthpiece into the instrument, your air goes from your lungs to the mouthpiece, all the way through the neck right here, all the way down the upper and lower joints, and then out the bell. We use keys, as you can see right here, to change how high and how low our notes can go. I'll play you some. A very, a very important key that we have on the instrument is right here. This is called the register key, and that will change the notes from being very, very low to very, very high. I will play you one little run going up and down without the register key and then one with so you can hear how it sounds. You can use the register key in combinations with not using it to make scales. That's the bass clarinet. The other instrument is the contra alto clarinet. Now this instrument is what we would call a fifth, a fifth lower than the bass clarinet. And as you can see, it's much larger and much longer. It has all the same things that the bass clarinet does, it's just lower. <laughs> It too also has a register key that lets it play high notes as well. These instruments are used in the concert band and they help to fill out the low end of any ensemble basically in your concert band settings or in your wind band settings. You see the bass clarinet more often than the contra alto, but they're still very, very fun instruments to play. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day, you guys.